what exactly what the screen saves look like. I'll go to add one. The one with me. There you go. That was created with Optimized Press. Optimized Press costs $97 and you can create unlimited sales pages, unlimited squeeze pages, and so on. You just fill in the blanks. Now, some of you guys are saying, well, Charles, why are you doing this? Isn't this, isn't this cutting into what you do for a living? No, not really. Because the clients that I work with are the clients that want higher end conversion. My, my ideal client isn't the do-yourself person. It's the business owner that looking for results based on a high conversion. So, so I have no problem teaching you guys about wholesaling, teaching you guys about website design, how to get a free website, none of that stuff. Because you guys would not normally be my ideal client if you're looking to do it yourself. Because I tell everybody that I work with, if you're doing it yourself, you're cutting out of your money making part of your business. Don't do it yourself. Yes? I was looking to add testimonials to the website. How much value does that have? That's, that's one of the biggest values. Remember we talked about, number one, referrals from friends and family and relations? When a person sees a testimonial, normally that would give that person a sense of authority. That site, that person is the real deal. Because if John liked them, I should like them, or I would like them. Now, it has lost value over the years because of fake testimonials. But it still has a high perceived value. One of the key things that you can have on your site right now that will give you great, should we say, oomph when it comes to authority, and you guys are going to laugh when I say this, it's the Better Business Bureau logo. The older, or should I say, the established clients look at that as a credibility badge, as a great way to say, well, they must be doing something good because they, were, they listed with the Better Business Bureau. Any other questions? I, I'm not just to make a comment. The DVD logo, mm -hmm. it's, there's a lot of fakes out there. Mm -hmm. So you click on it, and it spreads open, it's real. If you click on it, it doesn't know anything, it's fake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Any other questions? Going once. So retargeting program, is there a particular software that you can buy? Retargeting? Yeah. You can go to a site called retargeter.com. They start off at a cost of $500 a month minimum. You can go to Google AdWords. There is no starting off price there. You can start off with any campaign you want with any dollar amount you want. Or you can use a company called AdRoll.com. AdRoll doesn't have any price restrictions in regards to minimum or maximum either. AdRoll. AdRoll. A-D-R-O-L-L. -L. <coughs> any other questions? So remember, guys, presentation slides, video, where you want to go at to get them? Now, one of the things we have on that site, it goes with your real accountability bracelet. It's for you to put down your goals. Put down your, it's a way for you to track your goals and so on. That's built on that site. You can put them down on it. So that's, that's a, a key point to that website. Any other questions? How many of you guys ever just through, through cold call, knocking on doors? It's huge. It's a great way to get deals. But we only do cold calling when you're talking about motivated deals, motivated sellers. Somebody that you know that are in, that is in trouble. You go knock on that door. I have an agent that we did a marketing campaign from. And this agent, all they do, the campaign we set up for, is just for that agent to set to get leads so they can get people to do listings on their property that's in foreclosure. And we set a complete program that includes knocking on door, and include voice blast, and include tele and include email, and include the whole nine yards so that person can get listings um, from knocking on the door. That's where it start off with. What do you think about finding leads through a list broker? I love a list brokers. I love list brokers. And I, I, I think list brokers is one of the best sources for lists. Now, 
It's a money thing. Because in real estate, you're going to trade, you're going to have two things in place. Either it's going to cost you some money, or it's going to cost you some time. There's no way of getting around that. Those of you who have a little money to work with, you can build or go beyond that learning curve that the time is going to cost you. Those of you who don't, the key is putting in the time. But the key with your success will revolve around putting in the time doing things that is profitable. Because the minute, I mean, in this business, a lot of you, and this is the number one reason why investors quit this business. The number one reason, you know what it is? They waste their time doing things that's not making them money. And they get frustrated. For me, real estate didn't work until one thing. I made that first check. Now, if it takes a year for you to make that check, ain't you going to get frustrated? But if it takes two months, the frustration isn't there. How do you curve that? Make sure your plan revolves around productive activity, not wasting time, because you're going to get frustrated wasting time. I got one person that I'm doing coaching with right now on the, on the, co on the coaching calls. And I hope he doesn't mind if I talk, talk about this. Okay. One of the things we talked about recently was the fact that there's a little apprehension with certain questions, such as, how much do you owe on your mortgage? These are the things that you have to be an expert at. Years ago, I coined a phrase with Aspire America, and that phrase was, you have to be comfortable being uncomfortable. Ask the hard questions, the questions that make you squirm. Ask them. If you're comfortable being uncomfortable, it's over. There's nothing you can't do. Nothing. I took guys, I told you that I started off dropping out in the ninth grade. My biggest challenge, my biggest fear was writing. It took me two years to write my first book. Two years. Now I'm working on my second one. You can do this. It's not how you start. It's how you finish. That's the key. One more question. Um, you know, on the websites where they have a person come out and talk, do you think you get more of a success rate with that? The question is, when you have a website, because that website right there is me, as it was called a talking head. <laughs> How appropriate. Where I'm actually, the wholesale, the actual person, who, this is actually Bill's fellow site. And I'm actually coming in front of the screen telling people about why they should buy Memphis real estate, deals in real estate and stuff. And the conversion rate, yes, is higher on a talking head site, but it's just as high on a site that has video. Why? Because of the modality. People love video. One last thing before we get out of here. If you decide to start working with video, three to five minutes is all you need your videos. In fact, most people won't even go past two minutes on your video. 75% of your people, will you will lose them after two minutes. So keep that in mind, unless you're doing some type of training or something like that, and that's it. Okay. Okay, one last question. Okay, sorry, thank you. Uh, video editing program. Okay. Yeah. The best one out there, in my opinion, if you're using a Mac, it's called ScreenFlow. If you're using a Windows PC, it's called Camtasia. It's Camtasia. Now, let me back that up. It's not the best, I'm sorry. It's, it's the most user-friendly for the beginner. Okay. It's not the best. Um, um, now, a good free one that will get you there is Jing. Remember, Jing is free, but you can only record five minutes worth of video. J-I-N-G. Going once, going twice, let's go home.
Before everybody go, okay, before everybody go, three things I want to put out. First thing is this. Did y'all enjoy the meeting today? Yes. Did y'all feel like y'all got your money's worth? Yes. If you paid the hundred dollars, would you get your money's worth? Yes. Okay, good. Now what I want to ask you is this right here. This Tuesday and Saturday, anyone who will go to on Facebook, type in Kenneth M. Gill, and send some type of response about Charles, Blair, the mad scientist, and myself. What did you think about this meeting today? You will get a free consultation for 30 minutes on either Tuesday or Saturday, as well as an e-book on the most read book by successful entrepreneurs that ever existed. Anybody know what that is? Yeah, there you go. Think and Grow Rich. You will get that book emailed to you for free, as well as a 30-minute consultation. You post on Kenneth M. Gill's Facebook. What did you think about Charles Blair, the mad scientist, and myself as well? And as an extra bonus value, go to where, Charles? Real-accountability.com. And we also need you, the reason why we need you to put this out here is because aren't you glad you came here today? Yeah. I mean, think about all the information you would have missed if you didn't come. Now, think about how many others didn't come today and missed information. So we need you to let them know what you thought. So there's going to be a thing that will in your email as well. I say, what do you think about the Real Deal meeting? Give us your honest assessment of what you felt. And we do mean honest. If you didn't like Kenny, say you didn't like Kenny. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Joe. <laughs> give us your honest assessment. Okay? Now, after you give us your honest assessment there, I will then also, in turn, uh, communicate and send you the ebook as well. Okay? So, y'all got that right there? And we, the reason why we're doing this is because we need our purpose is to help more people. That's one purpose, but it's also self-serving because we're planning, as you see, we're starting to bust out the seams here. So we plan on moving this meeting to one of the hotels, and it will stay a free meeting. So that, we do have a, a, a larger, should I say, purpose in mind, but it revolves around you and you right. telling us, hey, let's keep it going. And that's the way we do. We have to, in order for it to help more people, we need you to spread the word about what you found here so that then we can come and in turn share the wealth here. Because this at the end of the day is Maryland, D.C., Virginia's most successful real estate investment club. And Charles, I want to make sure it remains alive. Thank you. Thank you.